Hello everybody! In this video I'm going to show you how to load your spreadsheet in Selfie in order to create your data definition. Let's start from the beginning. I create a new analysis and write the title and the description. Then Selfie asks me to choose the source of my data definition. But what is a data definition? It corresponds to the set of data self be created every time you load or connect and then select your data. Therefore, a data definition contains the specific data you have chosen to analyze. Now, I want to load a spreadsheet. So, I have just to click on the related button here and browse my folders. Or, simpler than that, I drag and drop my file here. See how the automatic selection of self B has individuated field cells among the empty ones, and it has selected them automatically, in very short time. Now I choose. Is it okay so? Or else do I prefer customizing my selection? To customize it, just click on Edit Data Selection. By default, self B has recognized the first row as title, and it has selected all the columns. But I want to select only some of these columns with all data inside them. How can I do it? I just select the first row of the columns I need and I tick both Selection includes titles and Extend selection vertically. Both these options are ticked by default. Instead, if I want to select only specific data area of the file, I have to select the area I need manually. And then untick Extend Selection Vertically. Finally remember, SelfP recognizes the interruption rows as end of the data selection. But how many interruption rows are calculated by default? Click on the gear icon to know it. Look, they are two but you can set this number by yourself, according to your needs. Are you satisfied now? So, you can confirm your selection here. Working on this panel is the next step. Here, you can refine your data, but this is the topic of another tutorial. Now, you can click on Close to go to Edit and shape your analysis with your new data definition. Always remember, that if you change idea about your data selection, you can always return to the window Select Data by clicking on Manage in the Data panel. That's all! And now it's your turn! Remember that your feedback makes self be even more self-service. So if you have any comments or questions, please contact us.